We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show. Hom 5 is upon us. The Patreon Patrons Picks series. Something along those lines. Triple P series is back. Hom 5 is where it's at. Rackety shlackety sh black black black. I got nothing. Alright. Um, yeah. We're, we're doing stuff. We took over uh, another undead town. <laughs> Down below the ground. Oh boy. Looks like we have more friends coming to hang out. Alright, what are you bringing to the table, sir? Not much. Alright, well, let's go crush your soul, too. And let's get eyes on wherever you're coming from, because this is, uh... This is the second time. One of y'all's is... Showing's up. Like, maybe like that? Maybe something like this? Might work. I, I don't know. Oh. No. Yeah. Yeah. Might as well do this. Kinda was hoping I could get a little something out of that with like a crit maybe, but that's okay. Probably gonna end up losing a couple of these, yeah. And then it really depends on whether or not these land. Oh, it did. Well, there you go. And there you have it. A couple of sprites for another finished off heroine or hero, if you will. Very interesting. Very interesting choice. Not what I was, uh... Didn't really expect them to do that. I don't know that I can really do too much right now, because I feel like from either side there could be folks coming to kind of rain on our parade. But, eh, we'll see. Alright, we'll do a little bit of that. to that as well okay uh, you're still on the road back well I suppose the good news is we just obliterated a barely sort of okay sized uh, group of baddies so that's less enemies that we'd have to deal with in the future, so... There is that. I suppose she should be down here by now. That's that's the plan, anyway. Alright, um... Yep, you are here. And you're gonna be heading this way. You, sir, are here. We're going to be heading down this way to take another item from them. Um, very, very nicely. And we'll see where that puts us. A little bit closer. I mean, I, I can town portal if I have to. Is that a dragon? Oh, it's a dungeon outpost. Eh. Whatever. Whatever. Oh, oh, there's something there. Oh, my God. Okay, well, I mean, I guess I can go kill that. It's probably fine. Anything showing up? Come and harass us anymore? Nothing yet. Alright, you go grab that. And head back here. Wish she had logistics. Um, you grab this. Sure, join. Cool. Head over here. Uh, 
uh, I think you go and grab this from him, and then, oh, uh, and then you head back in. Something along those lines. Yeah, that's all kind of working. All right. And then, oh, a bunch of fat babies. Oh, I kind of want them to join. Oh, well. I mean, they, they knew. They knew that they were in trouble. They're like, um, yeah, maybe. Oh, these guys want to fight, really. All right, the Dagrons get to hang out in the back, I suppose. All right, we'll see how this goes. Yep. Not well for them. All right. They're dead. I'm glad our guys are actually quick for once. That is not the norm. Normally our people are very slow and dumb. Alright, let's go ahead and do this. Nice, quick and easy split. Bring in more forces to bear. And we're back up to six dragons. Again, a little underwhelming, all things considered, but... Eh. Alright. Everybody's moved about as far as they can. I have eyes, just not as far down as I'd like. Mm. Alright, let's, um, let's upgrade you. Oh, you. There you go. Get you in motion. Get you here. Yeah, you can do that. That's yeah, sure, whatever. All right. Uh, I need you to do this to here, to there, to there. Come on, down. All right. And back to you. And drop it on him. Drop it on him. Drap it, drap it, drap it on them. And done. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Thank you. Enjoy your patronage and all that stuff. Junk and whatever. It's fine. Alright. Get back to your spot and... Gosh, where do we go with you? I guess here? I'll take that out. There's still a lot of exploration that we need to do up there. There's more stuff we got to do over here. That's that's him, right? That's Nikolai right there. He's like directly above us. All right, no, he's not. He's near us though. Oh, okay. We're we're catching up. He has Legion at this point, so I mean that's not great, but. I am Legion. Yes, yes you are, sir. Alright. Let's do a little bit of this. A little bit of that. A whole lot of other stuff. Alright. You'd think, like, by this point in in the, the HOM series, they would have a better, like, transfer all button. Did, did they have that in... in, like, three or something? Uh, they definitely didn't have it in three, sorry. I, I meant like maybe in four they had that, or... I don't think they even have that in six. They might have it in six. I know they had it in seven, or at least I'm pretty sure they had a transfer all in seven. But like, uh, I don't know. Or even, even like something like you, you can go and you can like mark like a specific thing you don't want to have swapped. I'd be cool with that, right? But no... Yo, they gotta have all these rules and regulations and stuff and junk and whatnot. Two, four, six, eight, and all that. Alright. I mean, we don't care about this at all. Oh, my god. That is not at all what I thought was over here.
I probably should have paid attention. If I'm being honest, it would have probably been a smart move, but I did not. Uh, I cannot do anything. Can I? Yeah, I'll just hit him with a regular basic attack. So I'll get you closer, and then it might be enough. Oh, it is. Oh, thank goodness for the crit. Was that defended by the dragons, or...? Yeah, that was de Okay. Didn't even see dragons there. A single dragon and some hydras, huh? Yeah, we'll do that. That, that, that feels good. Oh, that's not enough. Maybe with the uh, catapult hitting. There you go. Alright, doesn't matter. Our druid say goodbye to the the matriarch slash witch lady. She don't go here no mo. Well, he don't live here no mo. Alright, so shadow dragons there. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, I think we were in this general vicinity. Alright, there's a monolith there. I don't believe has been really like a huge issue yet. I, I, I'm very curious to see where this ends up at, so I'm going to kind of poke my head out real quick. But I don't think it's going to be much of anything for us. I'm pretty sure I can still teleport back to the town underground. Not positive, though. All right, where does this lead? Huh. Okay. Not what I was expecting. I don't... Yeah, I don't think I need to go this way, actually. Right now. That'll be a tale from another time, which I think I can just access from over here anyway, so... It's just a, a way of maneuvering, getting around a little bit. Uh, some hellhounds, some little doggos coming to, to play and hang out. I think we step back and we fight them from here. I don't know, yeah, I, say, I don't know that they can reach us from their spot. They are going to be short. All right, absolutely obliterated them. Did not do a whole bunch. Smack you guys a little bit there, and then uh, suit. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Okay, and some more treasure loot to be had here, because gold is a very important commodity. Though, so honestly, we're seemingly good on gold. Alright, well, well, we'll keep it moving. Alright, let's do the upgrade dance. Let's get all of that. Yeah, I know it's not gonna work. It's like maybe, maybe this time. Maybe this time. No, maybe this time. No. Alright. We got four more Dagrons ready to go. Will we be on our way. We got that. We got that. And Will we be on our way. Okay. What is next, you ask? I don't know. Not real sure myself, but we'll hopefully figure it out here soon. Alright. Uh, a little bit quicker this time, to be fair. All right, let's 
Let's get our buds back over here. Continuing to resupply our boy. And you can come down here and back into that. You're in, oh, you're not in position. So you should be. Where are you? What are you doing? Oh. You should be over here, man. I thought you were already over there. Slacker. Actually, you should be like there. And yeah, let's go take on the doggos once again. They cannot reach us, and well, they're just having a bad day in general anyway. Goodbye. Is that our is that our bow? Is that our infinite range bow? Oh, I hope so. Oh, it is. Oh, the blessed unicorn bow. See, yeah, alright, now, now hear me out, and you guys are all going to disagree because nobody likes the elves for whatever reason. It's fine. Um, now hear me out. The, the elves should just automatically have this as a thing. This should not be something that I need to grab and equip. This should just automatically be mine. We have a lot of stuff. You, you know you're in for uh, in for something when you opt to take two less uh, attack power just so you can have the infinite rate. You realize like how valuable that is. When someone like me specifically is like, yeah, two attack power, which, you know, I, I like hitting hard, right? It's all offense, no defense type situation. Uh, when I'm like, yeah, you know what? I'd much rather just be able to hit from a million miles away at full strength. All right, Alchemist Lab. I mean, there is almost assuredly, yeah. Like, there's almost assuredly a town down here. Almost guaranteed. I, I don't know that we can access it from over here, though. I think I'm willing to give it a shot. Meanwhile, back over here... We're heading down into dangerous uh, territory. You are heading into your position for the new week. And all right, let's uh, let's take a peek at our, our cities again. Is there a reason to, I mean, there's always a reason to kind of build magic, I guess. We could start doing that a little bit just in case. Then over here, I don't see a downside to even building these up at this point. Like, we absolutely could. There's, like, no, like, negative reason to not... You know, like, we have the we have the resources. It's not like we're almost out of money every week. We're, we're good. I might... Damn, that might bite me on the butt, but we also have a lot of, like, actual resource resources up here that we can sell to get more money if we do run short. And now with, oh, you know what I should be doing is making sure we're getting the maximum out of the other cities that we have here. It's so like, this one, done, right? No, no problem there. But this one is just a kind of a garbage city. I guess we're getting all the money we can out of that. It's not that bad. Okay, that's, that's fine. All right, I'm gonna have you come on down, and I'm gonna have you continue your adventure down this way. Yeah, we're gonna deal with the ghosts. Ooh! Survive two out of three attacks. Oh, I can cross the. Oh, that's interesting. I actually didn't think I'd be able to. Well, they're going to have a new week's worth of uh, troops, but it's not really going to do anything. At least I don't think. They may have a hero over here doing something. There's also a dragon there. Ooh, that'll be fun. Uh, oh, wait. Hold on. Uh, yeah. So I'm not ready yet. You need to... You still need to get into position here. All right. Let's end of that turn. It is still slow going. 
was relative the week of arbitration. Why, why is it all so weird sounding? Uh, skill level of all light magic spells increased to maximum during battles. I mean, that sounds great for me, except for the part where I don't need that. And I don't use light magic spells. But, you know, also really good for me. Probably. Alright, uh, let's grab this. Join. Hustle. Flow and all that. Uh, snag this from you. Over here. Buff, 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 buff you up. Alright, and then we're gonna go here. And yeah, we're just gonna do this because we are lazy right now. And. We're going to head out. Uh, I don't know who's actually further ahead at this point, but. Yeah. I think it may even behoove us to get one more hero, probably. I think we can uh, cut a lot of this down even further if we get one more hero out doing this stuff. So I think we're going to do that for our next week. Meanwhile, he is still on the deliver the troop charge. And did they fortify more? Uh, I can't tell. If they did, it's not much. It's not much of a, of a change of what was going to happen either way. Oh, but this is going to suck a lot more. So there's that. Alright, well, let's get hit by it all. Ouch. 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 We got some lightning bolt action. Yeah, might as well do that. A little bit going on there. I believe we got some ice bolts for you. Oh, that's just not quite. Oh, so it's not quite enough, but we moved her into a good position and we did it. Minor losses. And they already had a full town gate, so we didn't even have to build that. That's great. It's really, really nice. Um, let's go claim this. Then we can head back in, see if there's any spells to be had. I have no idea what they actually built in there. Um, spell... Sure, Magic Guild level 2, why not? Cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Um, actually, let's let's look at what spells we have here. First circle spells. Uh huh. Say, I mean, I feel like I have these already. I mean, I do. I do have them already. Okay. Uh, we'll end the turn, and uh, I believe we'll get our reinforcements in the next turn. And then I think we can clear the rest of the underground. Probably. I, I think that might have been the only two towns that are actually down here. If that is the case, fantastic. I am super happy about that. Um, we have that? We do have that. I will even reach across the river to get this from him. All right, now we're really starting to feel pretty good. Double digits on the dragons. Nope, that didn't work. All right, so what I would have liked in this is for that to automatically be there. So if you type a number, it just automatically accepts it. That would uh, speed things along a little bit. Again, small, really unimportant like request there, but still something I think would have been nice. I kind of wish like... I know it doesn't make sense because there's, you know, everybody has their own different tastes and uh, not everybody, it'd be hard to find a source that would be worth listening to, but sometimes I wish 
and again, I'm years after this release, right? Like, there, there's no reason at this point for them to do anything. I mean, they could. They still could come, like, patch it or something. But I just don't see that being worth it for them. Um, anyway. Um, I, I wish that they would, like, talk to somebody who, who, who like, understands and was like, Hey, here's some quality of life improvements that would really, really, really improve the game. Like, for instance... Um, Fix the cursor so you don't have that slight line there. That's so weird that that got through the the, the quality assurance, you know, the QA. Like, how how did that happen? You guys see the little line to the left of the of the the gauntlet there. Like, it's tiny thing that really doesn't matter much. And it even goes away when it switches to the finger, but they just didn't crop the uh, icon correctly. That's such a small, easy fix. And it just was either never important enough to do, or it was never pointed out to them. Like I, I don't, I don't know what what's what the deal is with it, but that's just so crazy that that's a thing, you know? That they have that thing just there. It's like, why? How did that? How did that happen? Um, like I said, when you're splitting troops, just to be able to immediately type would be fantastic versus having to actually go up and click on the thing to actually do the typing like it, it's a small silly thing but like that alone just saves you a lot of time energy and effort right so it, it's it's like small things like that that the developers and, and stuff probably aren't even going to think of they're like oh you know what that's a good idea and it's not like they're stupid they're, they have all the other insane things that they have to worry about these are just small things that absolutely could slip through the cracks so I think I'm actually going to send this guy over here. I am going to hire a new something. Yep, this guy. All right. And, uh, yeah. We'll be prepared for uh, next time. It'll be fine. All right. Yeah, like I said, I, I have a lot of little ideas. I, I, I honestly really would love it if... And, and I know it's not going to happen. And again, um, I'm... One of the more people, I'm one of the people that's more positive about Ubisoft, uh, and by more positive, I mean I I actually enjoy the Ubisoft uh, Hom games. While I know a lot of the vocal minority, at least I assume it's that, um, just complain about everything, right? In uh, this fandom, so for me, it would be like a, a another dream come true to actually be able to like have Ubisoft go, hey, you know what? Uh, we'd like you to consult on Palm 8 and, you know, talk to me and let me, you know, share my thoughts of like, this is why so you know, this is why these people specifically are opposed to this and that, and you're never gonna be able to please everyone, you're really gonna have to, you know, like, I have a ton of ideas of, like, just pitfalls to stay away from and things that you're just gonna have to shrug off because it's not really like gonna be your fault that this stuff happens this being uh you know ubisoft it's just like this is just the way it's going to be and you're just gonna have to accept that move on type situation so yeah it's um well we'll see i guess i'll leave the unicorns Ooh. Oh, okay, that's uh, different than I was expecting. I thought that they could reach all the way in one shot. So they'll hit our trees, which is not going to do enough. Our trees will end them, and then we can just pick these guys off pretty easily. Alright, works for me. Boop, boop, gone. Alright, very cool. We didn't hear Finden complain about the, the, the stinky dead dragons? No? Alright, cool, cool, cool. Now, could I personally design all the way from top down uh, HOM 8 and make it incredible where everybody loves it? I highly doubt it. Uh, people don't want to like HOM at this point in time. Like, they really don't. If they did, they would have liked several of the HOMs that uh, already exist. And they just don't, right? Y yeah, the heart. Look, I like, I understand enjoying. The, you know, like HOM 1, HOM 2, HOM 3. 
uh, and Hom 4, right? I, I can understand that. And then like, oh, well, they went out of business and now somebody else is doing it. They're not doing as good of a job or whatever the case is, right? Like that, that's your, your mentality. Like, oh, well, the original people who were doing it aren't doing it anymore. I don't care about it anymore. So on and so forth. Like you can have that mentality, but it's just so limiting, you know? It's, it's as they say, not a, ooh, that is basic logistics. It's not a good look. I suppose is the the best way to, to phrase it because like there's still a ton of merit to the current gen Homs and honestly I I do believe that Hom 5 is probably the best Hom out there right now Hom 7 again it, maybe it's all been fixed at this point but just because it was as broken as it was um, couldn't quite take the uh, the cupcake on that one, but still, eh. It is what it is. What it is. It is. It is. Good stuff. Compelling. Rich. Fine. All right. Cool. Getting uh, basic logistics is going to be just fantastic for us. Can't wait. All right. So we're going to like tag stuff and claim things as we go through. It's probably going to take a few episodes just to get through the underground. We are continuing to get stronger. It looks like we're maybe on par with uh, with these guys. We're definitely stronger than most of these little baby armies. The big one here is this guy right there. And we're on par with him. And everybody else is a little bit weaker. So maybe if they amalgamate all their forces, that'll be a problem to us. But I don't think so right now. Yeah, man. Ah, Hom 8 would be fantastic. I would love that so very, very, very much. Oh, I'd be so good. But, eh. It is what it is. Like I said, the original Hom's great. And, yeah, it's a little sad and it kind of sucks that, you know, uh, 3DO and New World Computing, you know, they died off. But, the IP lives on. It's still Hom, whether you... I, I, again, I never quite understood the like, like the art style. That's like one of the big complaints. It's a Hom game, guys and gals. It, does, does it, it? I'd say it doesn't matter because it doesn't matter. But also, this looks bad to you. Like really? I mean, I, I understand some of the cutscenes definitely didn't age well at this particular moment. Uh, but back in the Hom 5 days, like in, in the heyday of Hom 5, that looked pretty good. Pretty good. Also, even beyond that, um, everybody seems to forget that, and, you know, the people will make excuses and so on and so forth, but, like, Hom 4 is generally considered not... I won't say considered the worst. Uh, it, it's just, it's the most disliked. A lot of people just hate on Hong 4. Uh, that was still 3DO and New World Computing. So, you know, you guys don't need to hate on everything. Uh, they've even brought back many of the developers that worked on some of the original games to uh, previously work on like Hom 7 extra, the extra DLCs, the free DLCs. They brought back uh, the folks that were still working, that like created stuff and written things for Hom 4. I mean, like, Ubisoft's tried a lot to please the fan base, and just they're they're just nasty people, and it sucks. Because like, if every if every time you guys made a game that's actually good, like don't get me wrong, these are good games, and I know you guys are, many of you are very oh, it's terrible, blah, 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 blah. but like they're legit good games, and you know every time you do this, and you're like, oh, this is this is good. We we did we switched developers, uh, we're trying something new. Uh, we're, we're trying to stay true to the, you know, the, the, the way the whole game works out. We're trying to make sure that people are happy, kind of throwback stuff, this, that, and so on and so forth. And just every time people crap on it, they even want like a completely new direction, trying to simplify it, maybe getting outside fans and whatnot with Hom 6. People didn't like that either. I'll admit Hom 6 took a while for me to, to enjoy as much as I do. Like it had to grow on me type situation, you know? It was like, oh, this looks so cool. This is very enjoyable. I like this. And then I'm like, it just doesn't feel quite right, you know? There's something not right. It's very different. Like, a lot of stuff has been simplified. A lot of stuff has been made 
uh, while more simple, like much more accessible, a lot easier to deal with, like being able to recruit from any of your towns. As long as you have the buildings, you can pull all of your forces to that. That's fundamentally a massive shift in the game and it changes everything. Being able to convert enemy towns, like we have two undead towns, three, excuse me, three undead towns. We can convert those to our own towns just to build a super army. That's incredible. That is, that's such a cool thing to be able to do. But again, fundamentally, absolutely changes everything. It's maybe bad. I don't know, but it's it's something different. They they tried to, to innovate and tried to do something that wasn't done before. And again, just everybody crapped on everything. It's just it's disheartening for me as a as a Hom fan to just know that there's so much hatred and disrespect and just oh I don't care how good or bad the game is I'm just gonna hate it on principle alone because it's Ubisoft or it's a triple A game or 3DO is not around or whoever owns the IP like there's really nothing bad about these games and I I, I can't I don't know I, I just can't fathom it and like I, I hear some of the arguments people make and it's just so silly like to me this game looks great the map, the 3D map's a little hard to maneuver around. I actually really like how I ended up building up um, Hom 6's controls, because I had to do it out of necessity, because there was no lock mouse to screen. And without that, I was like, oh. Anyway, so I, I really like my control scheme for that. It's weird, and other people would take a while to get used to, but it's not bad. I do, I do think the map is a little too easy to move right now with this one. But, again, that's just me. That's just me. Alright, we're going to do another turn or so, and then we're going to end it. I know we're going a little bit long. But, again, I I'm rambling. I'm not really ranting. I'm not, like, upset or hating anything. It's just, I want more hum. And I just really hope that we get it. And I hope that people just stop all the hate. Just enjoy what you guys get. Enjoy it. I, I even like the idea and the fact that they've like branched out and tried other things with the Hom series. There was like a puzzle game that I played, like Hom Clash of something or another. I was like, this is weird, but kind of cool. Um, I I like the idea that there are mobile games out there. If they were a bit more true to what Hom is all about, I'd be a little bit more enthusiastic about it maybe, but uh, mobile games aren't really my thing. I know a lot of people love mobile games. I, I play very few things on my phone. I mean, I've got, like, everything else. Why I don't really understand why I want to do stuff on a phone. But again, this isn't uh, like a judgment on anyone who uses their phones and plays games on it. It's just for me, it's not really a thing that I care much about. Uh, but, like, the last two or three entries in the HOM series have been mobile mobile games which is uh not good right that's a bad omen and then i think that they had um was it just a might and magic or was it a hom the the dior diorama one where you could then like build up units and fight each other and it was like an auto battler or something i i don't remember they sent it to me and for what it was it was fun but then you had to like fight other people and uh, it's just, again, not really my thing. Like, they, they keep trying to do extra things and, like, bring more stuff into it, but I just want a HOM 8. That's that's all I want. Just give me a HOM 8. I mean, this franchise has been around for decades. It's got a lot of backstory. It's got a lot of history. It is still considered, though, you know, honestly, I've seen HOM mentioned much less in recent years, uh, recent months even, um... Like, no mention of it at all, of, like, you know, best game ever made, you know, this, that, and so on and so forth. Like, uh, I'm not going to say, like, Hom has, like, fallen off completely and, like, nobody knows it exists anymore, but it it is uh, part of a dying breed, so to speak. Um, us, us elder statesmen and women are the only ones who really uh, still know and appreciate the, the Hom series. I don't think a, a tremendous amount of younger folk, and, and again, there's just nothing against them. They just, like, how do you know stuff that you've missed unless you're actively looking for it, right? It's just, it's just one of those things. That's why, like, 
there's certain references I make where I'm like, ah, yeah, this is, and then I'm like, you know, people probably don't get that at all. I'm like, I, I'm old. <laughs> I'm getting old. This is, uh, this is weird. Like references that everyone in my generation, uh, and you know, around my generation would have gotten easily. It's just now completely lost. They're like, what? I, I don't know what that is. And I'm like, oh no. Oh no, I've become old. What has happened? When did this happen? But uh, again, I, I hope Hom lives on. I hope more and more Homs come out. I'd love to see at least 10 in the series. I'd love to see more than that, but I think 10 in the series would be a really, really nice uh, milestone for them to go for. And uh, just, you know, see what happens. All right, let's end this, start the new week, and then we'll end the episode. And that'll be it for my recordings for tonight. Um, I think we recorded like six, five, six episodes. It was good. It was a good day of recording. I also recorded a bunch of other stuff today, too. I won't be able to talk for like three days. Uh, I've not done a tremendous amount of recording as of late. I've been uploading stuff that I've had and doing spot recordings when and where I had to. Stuff that was coming out and releasing and whatnot. So, I haven't really grown like a lot of extra stuff so uh, I'm trying right now to bulk up for when we go on vacation I heard that the money got transferred out of my bank account for the passport so hopefully that's being processed and will be sent in time for me to actually make the trip and we're still hoping and waiting on permanent residency uh, re renewal card coming back as well so I can get back into the country after we leave <sighs> hate paperwork hate government stuff but it's all done. Hopefully it all works out. Cross your fingers, guys and gals. I have no idea when this episode is going to go up. Uh, right now, it's still near the end of March. So I'm going to guess this episode is probably not going to go up until mid-April or later. We'll see. Anyway, folks, I hope you guys enjoyed. I, again, every once in a while, I like to ramble. I like to do stuff, especially when we're in kind of a... This is a little bit of a slower-paced area, right? There's not a lot of fighting. There's not a lot of stuff going on. Uh, having to ferry the troops takes time, so I, I will tend to ramble and try to keep you guys relatively entertained if I can as uh, we do all the uh, more tedious parts of, of the Hom series. Anyway, that's it. Till the very next episode, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer. <laughs>